Hello guys, it is Futon here, and welcome to a loot video from something that is new that um, seemingly I can get the monkey Grigri, the ancient monkey Grigri from, um, which is the Holy Scarab. Um, yeah, uh, I'm going to be banging, what it does is it allows you one bone, and I'm going to burn through around 4,000 of these in an attempt to try to get this, uh, see what you can get the monkey head from it. I've not seen anyone do it. But either way, and um, we're going to be basically going through a brand new way of uh, resetting summoning pots and banking this. I'm going to do this without no paper just because it's not really that bad because of how I do this. But anyway, um, to basically get your prayer points back, the fastest way is hopefully you have a master quest cape, but if you don't, you're going to need to bring in the cabbage cape and go to behind or the cabbage disc of returning or whatever go to behind the scenes go into the life altar and literally leave the life altar by leaving the life altar it resets everything including your summoning points on your familiar and you literally can just go basically ham on this um that's the reason why it's going to be pretty quick to do um but however if you're not a master quest cape owner i would highly suggest you bring no paper um, because I own the Master Quest Cape, I can say I don't care and not bring it at all. Anyway, I'm using, well, a good bit over 4,000 scrolls, so let's see if I get the piece or not. If I don't get the piece, oh well. If I do get the piece, yay. Um, let's go from there, because I'm really skeptical that it even has it. I saw two Reddit articles. And I thought, hey, this would make a nice loop video either way, so might as well do it. So I will be back um, within when I'm done. So see you guys um, then. Oh my god, it's real. Oh my fucking god, it's real. No way. No fucking way. Oh my god. Well, boys and girls, it's real. It's a real item. Uh, holy shit. Reddit was right. Well, Von Luna said they were right, but Reddit was right. Holy shit. <laughs> well, let's finish this off, and then we can just say we're done. We're done, we're done, we're done, we're done. Well, this took literally forever. <laughs> Legit lasted forever to do this. Um, I'm gonna double check that I did cast enough because I did destroy some at the very beginning because I wasn't intending on making a video, but I decided to do so. So give me one second while I go and do that, and then we will go through what we really got here. Well, it seems I slightly did over 5k the more than I thought because Wyvern Bones wasn't in the pile at all. So you get about 5,000. 50, 60 here. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and withdraw these and bring up the hoop, what the zoomed in, and then go ahead into detail of what we've really got here. Quite a bit. I'm I'm a little surprised here. So, okay, guys. So ironically enough, you cannot put um no tube bones, mangled bones, long bones, and curved bones. So we're gonna go over this right now. In a total of five thousand like fifty scrolls. Um, you get a t I got in a total of 250 Joker Bones, 123 Reinforced Dragon Bones, 161 Baby Dragon Bones, 2,714 Normal Bones, 244 Joker Bones, 129 Dinosaur Bones, 255 Bat, 126 Eret, 200, or no, 122 Frost, 132 dragon, 120 hardened dragon, the legendary monkey scroll. It's a real thing. I actually did get it, as you've seen in previous clips. Um, five long bones, three curved bones, 246 wolf bones, 126 wyvern bones, 121 dragon can bones, 121 dagonauts. And if I look at my bank really quick, I don't think you're gonna be able to see it right here. 35 mangled and 50 chewed, 
Uh, from what it looks like, you either roll for the bone drop or you get one of the extras. And it looks like you have around a 50% or higher chance of hitting just literally just hitting bones. Nothing more. Um, which means there looks like a few things that they took off the table, mainly the warg and forg bones or something like that, off compared to the zombie imps. But these can now drop air at bringing forest dragon bone, frost dragon bone, and everything else. And it looks like they're all really close, to be honest with you, for a 5,000 spread. And then these ones seem to be, um, these mangled and chewed seem to be a very rare table. Um... But yeah, that's really how it seems to be layered here. Um, hopefully this was helpful to you guys. And um, I'm going to assume that this thing... Um, I did talk to someone and he said he had had multiple of these at the same time. So there's nothing stopping you from getting more than one. And I got one in 5,000. Um, there was two Reddit posts that people got them in 500. Um, which is what sparked to do this video. I think the honest drop rate probably is about the same as it is for the zombie imp and being around a 1 in 3,000. Um, that's just my opinion, but um, of course I can always just be wrong. But I figured I'd go ahead and state that out here. That's my rough estimate of this if you're specifically after this item. Um, but that's pretty much it for this video. Hopefully this was helpful to you, and I'm so glad that I got this item. Um, the next thing I'm probably going to do is, I think, in a loot from a crap ton of Pyramid Plunder chests because I need now to get a Scepter of the Gods because of this update. So, thank you guys very much for watching and have a wonderful day.